hi guys welcome back to the channel today i'm making dinner rolls it's my first time so let me know how i did i think they actually turned out quite well you know so um the ingredients um as you can see here uh we've got some butter some melted butter some sugar uh instant yeast uh some salt some warm milk and some flour mix uh, one tablespoon of sugar with the warm milk Sprinkle the yeast on the milk. Let it sit for a minute and then um, whisk the mixture again until the milk is frothy. Let the mixture sit for another 5 minutes and then add the remaining sugar, the melted butter and the salt. Gradually add in the flour using um, your whisk to incorporate it into the mixture um, And then as the dough gets thicker you can move to dough hooks If you're using your hands um, then uh, you can start by using spatula And then um, as the dough gets thick you can switch to kneading it with your hands Place the dough in a well old bowl um, and cover with a clean wrap or wick dish cloth for about 2 hours. After 2 hours uh, it should have doubled in size and in warmer areas it can actually take less time as long as it is uh, doubled in size. Um, this is actually um, my first batch. Uh, I had to preheat the oven a little bit and then um, switch it off to create a warm atmosphere. As you can see, the dough is, uh, is doubled in size. It's nice and airy. This is my earlier batch that I actually just left it in the sun, but there was a hole in my clean wrap and it didn't rise that much and it had like a hard layer so uh, when you're making um, your dough when you're uh, putting it out to rise you just need to be careful of that place the dough on a lightly floured surface and uh, just knead it for a little bit and then um, cut it into uh, however many pieces uh, you want if you want 15 rolls then you cut it into uh, 15 um, even pieces I tried doing it with my hands but because um, you know it was just so difficult I ended up using the knife the recipe I was following actually said use a, 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 a dough cut and I had no idea what that is but a knife actually uh, did the same purpose it helped me to actually just cut it nicely so um i did that i wanted 15 rolls because we're family of five um yeah and so that's what i did
even this paste the pieces on a greased uh, a baking dish or whatever um, you're using to actually bake the rolls in and then cover with clean ramp and then place in a warm uh, place uh, for about 20 to 30 minutes just until they've risen and or doubled in size Half an hour later, they are ready to go in the oven and they've doubled in size. You might want to use a, a dipper dish so that um, the clean wrap or the towel doesn't cling to the dough. But you can just put them in the oven at 350 degrees Fahrenheit or 180 degrees Celsius for about 20 minutes or until the tops are golden brown. Brush the tops with melted butter and then leave the rolls to cool. Wow guys, would you look at that nice, soft, airy and delicious, not bad for my first time. Please um, like and comment and just let me know if you've tried this and yeah, you can have them just as is or you can have them with soup. We actually made them with soup and I'm going to be doing the a video of how I, um, I did that soup but Thanks so much guys for watching. Please like, subscribe if you're not a subscriber and see you in the next video.